did you realize you had the potential to be able to do it? And then um, when did Dodge Sports come into play for you? Yeah, um, you know, I, I'm pretty confident in my abilities and what I bring to the table. So I always knew I could do it. It was a matter of who was going to give me the chance to do it. This is a sport, and unfortunately in any, you know, and even in the NFL, if you wanted to become an NFL agent, an MLB agent, or MLS agent, uh, to break in is hard um, if you're not starting your own. So I always teetered with the thought of, well, do I just do it on my own and hustle and hustle, 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 and eventually make it? Or, you know, do I try to work for somebody? But then, you know, when I thought of that, I, I always hit a wall because no one's just handing out opportunities to a random person who has no experience in the sport. So I knew I had to create my own opportunity and, um, you know, learning things through the media side of and how to book interviews, I came or I started to see that there's specific roles, you know, for people to do that. Um, I decided to reach out to Matt Dodge at the time. Uh, and I was just like, Hey, I would, you know, can I interview any of your fighters? Uh, he gave me, I think, two names. I ended up reaching out to them to interview. After the interviews were done, I fell in love with his fighters and I fell in love with how good that, you know, how highly they spoke of him. And, and I knew that was different in this game. So um, I ended up writing to him and I was like, hey, man, like, uh, I don't know if you have a team, but I would love to ramp up the PR of Dodge Sports, book your clients for interviews across, you know, media outlets. I have a lot of connects, obviously, you know, managing my own site and hiring a bunch of people who have gone off to work for bigger sites. Um, and I was like, yeah, you know, I, I would love to do that for you. Is there an opening? He was straight up and he was like, I can't pay you. Um, but so what would you want out of this? And I was like, you, I want you to teach me the ways. I, I want to learn how to become an agent. I will do this for free as long as you teach me. And we were doing it for six months. I got to learn. I got to read contracts. I got to learn how the sport worked. I got to learn how to recruit. I got to learn how to, um, you know, what to say on the calls and, and how to, you know, approach a fighter. I learned about fight promotions, fight contracts, all that, all the good stuff. So six months into it, um, I was like, all right, man, I'm ready. And if you're not ready to sign me as an agent, then I do think I have to move on. And man, the next day I had a contract in my inbox and I became an agent that day. So um, it was a, it's a special story to me. You know, sometimes you got to hustle. Sometimes you got to do it for free to somebody, for somebody to see uh, what you're worth. Um, and then once you get the chance, man, you got to blow it out of the park. So, you know, I kudos to Matt for taking a chance on me. Uh, I didn't think anyone would. And um, I've learned so much, man. I'm so grateful. I kickstarted my career. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be where I'm at today if I did it on my own.